and Nike Chizoba has been having pain on her hips since yesterday. It became worse after she woke up this morning. But when the man of God prayed, he said, place one hand on your body and raise the other one up. And Nike Chizoba wrote that instantaneously she was healed and the pain disappeared. Praise the Lord. And now, all the way from Ifoma Ogbodo, online, the train of divine touch touched her as she has been having pain in her ankle for some time. But after the prayer of the man of God, something again about the final amen. And after the final amen, the pain miraculously and instantly disappeared. Praise the Lord. Precious Cyprian received a precious miracle. He said, I thank God for his divine touch of healing upon my life tonight. Specifically, he was healed from recurring infection that started a few months ago. After the prayer, infection is gone. Praise the Lord. And now we go all the way again from online. This is coming from Sister Buki. Re divine touch she received happened to touch a stomach pain which started today. The pain has been disturbing such that even throughout the message, she could not really concentrate. But towards the end of the message, she felt a sensation in her tummy. And after the prayer, Lo and behold, the pain vanished completely. Amen. We take you to the United Kingdom, where Sister Debari wrote, I've been having severe pains at my right shoulder for four years now. Before the JS preaching, she told herself that she would believe. And at the end of the message, after that final amen, healing took place and she said she read till 3 a.m this morning and found out that all the pains had totally disappeared praise the lord and now this is coming from priscilla Ayogmi Ayomiku. she says i have a wonderful testimony and this has been about a divine church releasing my kidnapped friend we have been praying since yesterday and the divine touch as was going on today she was released thank you jesus we move finally to river state live before we return to the state overseer and here is the testimony live from river state praise the lord this is another testimony coming from river state right here in the Bonnie region we can see our father here. He's been going through sharp pains since the year 2012 after he was hit by a strange bullet. But by the grace of God, at the amen of the man of God tonight, the whole pains of 12 years is done. Praise the Lord. You can hear from him now. I thank God for God has healed me. My name is Sonny Johnson in Bonin region. And I thank God for healing me today, today, just today, as the man of God prayed, and then I got the healing. After final, amen. Amen. And now we return to the state of Asia. to take the next testifier and as 
and listen to the testimony, please keep checking yourself. I will never live here the same. Let's listen to the next person, please. Praise the Lord. Praise the living Jesus. My name is Damian Honor Andrew. I'm from Isuzo region. And I want to thank God for how God delivered me from a pain. I had a pain on my right ear. It was disturbing me since last semester. It was very difficult for me to read each time the pain starts. Even this semester, it started like that. It goes, it comes. But I told God this program, I'm going to receive my touch. And I received this touch yesterday, but I could not give the testimony. So this evening, I said I am going to testify that I have received my touch. Praise the living Jesus! Put your hands together for Jesus. The Lord touched him yesterday. He wanted to be sure. Now he's sure. And he came and gave testimony. Another person, please. The next testifier. I am Ayubnam Victory Tochuku. I am from Atala, Okanot in Anambra State. It is a joyful thing to see the man of God. Throughout his ministration, my inner man was revived and was refreshed. And I pray God give him more hundred years ahead in his ministry. In Jesus' name, amen. Put your hands together for Jesus. Amen. The next person, please. Very quickly. Praise the Lord. My name is Annie David. I'm from Amod region, deep alive. The Lord has been great for me. What he done for me is not easy. A woman cannot do it for me, any man cannot do it for me. I will never ever doubt my God, though. I will never doubt Amen. my Please God. Please go to your... I will never ever doubt my God, though. His mercy is for real. I can never ever doubt Thank my you, please, God. Brother. Let's have I can your never testimony. doubt my God. Though. I can never ever doubt my God. The next testifier, please. Please go straight to your testimony when you get there, please. Your name, your testimony. Please, no singing, please, so that others can be given opportunity. Praise the Lord. My name is uh, Sister Angela Ungoge from Aku region. I want to bless the name of the Lord for the great things that he has done for me and for this my little girl here. It was during the last uh, crusade, since I wonders for the needy, that the Lord Almighty visited me. So, I was from, suffering from ulcer for good 12 years now, but during the, the crusade, after the ministration of the man of God, and now we, we now went home. And even this, my little girl was suffering from ulcer too for about six years and now. So after the administration of the man of God on the last side of the crusade, we now went home. And this girl called to our dad and said, Daddy, do you know that the ulcer is gone? She, so he said to her, how do you know that the ulcer is gone? So she narrated everything uh, about the, the thing because she used to vomit uh, blood before. But after the, the prayers, this, everything concerning the author just vanished away. And it reminded me of something that I should check up myself too. And I checked up myself, the severe pains caused by the author, everything about the author, I found out that everything vanished away. 
And I bless the name of the Lord. Praise the Lord. Put your hand together for Jesus. Did you not hear that testimony? The child has been suffering also, even sometimes vomiting blood. But now, after the prayer, during the last program, everything was cleared up. No more vomiting of blood, no more also. Put your hand together for Jesus. And keep examining yourself because the Lord has done it for you too. That's another miracle happening. Bring, let him come this way. Let him come this way. Bring him, bring him down this way. I tell you, as the testimony is going on, miracle power abilities, keep checking yourself. It has happened. It has happened. It has happened. Why the testimony is going on, check yourself. You must not take your problem home. Leaders interview them and make sure everything is well ordered. Amen. We take the next testifier, the next testimony, please. After that, we go to online audience. Another has happened. I'm telling you, the testimony is going on. It's happening right there where you are. Let's listen to the next testifier, please. Praise the Lord. By God's grace, my name is Brother Anointy, all the way from Kongi State, Anta region. I'm here to testify the goodness of God upon my life. For more than five years, I'll be having serious chest pain in my body here, in my left side. So believing God yesterday, having faith in Him, I see God do touch me with divine touch in my life and that pains for more than five years disappear immediately and also seeing God healing me yeah, this evening I see how God touched me I was healed of shoulder pain this evening praise the Lord put your hand together and celebrate this great miracle of God amen keep checking yourself as you see the miracle you come out Let's hear from our online audience, please. And remember, tomorrow's meeting starts by 4 p.m. 4 o'clock tomorrow. Let's listen to our online audience, if we have some. From the online, miracles happening instantaneously. Victory Hwantia had nausea, vomiting, and stomach disorder. This happened after she drank some things given to her by her parents, despite her disapproval. It got worse for four weeks. The problem got so serious, no appetite to eat, and she was lying down after all the problems. But during the prayer, the man of God prayed, she wrote, I suddenly became strong. I jumped up and I said, I want to eat, and I don't throw up again. God has done wonders in her life. Praise the Lord. And this is coming live from Facebook. Again, something about that final amen. Joy Okenwa says, I had this pain after a 20-kilometer run, and as a result, serious pains on my both legs. But at the final amen tonight, the pains disappear. Praise the Lord. All the way from the United Arab Emirates, I'm Isosa wrote i am watching from my workplace i had running nose and i had serious aches immediately after the prayers as the man of god finished everything dried up instantaneously and he wrote i am healed completely praise the lord and now i have this from blessing sonia wakama on facebook the divine touch came upon her and depression is gone. More testimonies coming from the social media. As from the international perspective, we see this testimony written. He says, I have been having pains all this while. 
but the pains just after the prayer of the man of God vanished away. This is Joy Okinwa from London. And then we have this other one from Bene Republic. A particular sickness was eating this man's bones in the leg. And the leg that was supposed to be cut off got miraculously healed tonight after the prayer of the man of God. According to his writing, I have thrown away the cane. I can walk perfectly now. Praise the Lord. We now return to the state overseer. Put your hands together for such testimonies. God is